Welcome back to Real VR Fishing. We're playing the Quest Native version on a Meta Quest 2. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers, it would be fantastic if you were one of them. Also like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video, or the game, or any tips or tricks you have for Real VR Fishing. Let's get to it. We are going to be playing the US West DLC and we're going through the saltwater locations. So let's see. Last time I think we did the uh, Big Sur coast but we didn't spend a lot of time there. We'll probably get back to there but for now Let's check out San Francisco Bay. Ah, uh, that's nice. So, we've got casting rod A, casting reel A, spinner A, and uh, expert mode on with uh, line color so that you'll be able to see what I'm doing by the color of the line and uh, it's easier for me as well. Okay, seems like a small fish. I'm going to try to treat small fishes like big fish. against the runs. I'm gonna stop reeling at the red. Might get a jump here. Nope. We'll let the blues and greens work hard to get our snaps. Yellowfin croaker. Caught a fair number of them. saw some sort of distortion over here. Now I've heard if you see bubbles it means the fish is deep and if you see just movement on the water then the fish is shallow so you can let your lure sink accordingly. Another small fish. Didn't run at all. It's coming right in. Ooh, little guy. Pacific herring. Gonna be a while before we can afford the sailboat. Not gonna lie. I see some bubbles over there. Looks like it's heading towards our our lure. No, not quite, but um, good to see. So you can see some bubbles kind of directly ahead and then off to the right you can see that kind of surface distortion where you can almost see the uh, shadow of the fish so to speak. Must be pretty deep here. I'm not feeling the bottom. Oh, there's the bottom. Oh, this one's running. Okay. We got some green. That's always good. Let him go. Reel on the blue. go reel on the blue we're gonna get a jump got the snap Ooh, we got some green pull them on in let him go we're gonna get another jump or he's too close 
too close, I think. I'm going to go back to letting go right when I see the red. I've been pushing it into the kind of pale red. Did we just catch a shark? Huh, leopard shark. Look at that. That wasn't that hard. Looking good. Keeping you going in the tank. Nice. Maybe we can catch another leopard shark. So one thing I noticed was that uh, some fishermen, they don't reel when they're pulling against the runs. I've been doing that. I've just been kind of reeling like a madman as long as it's not red or blue. But I'm going to start just pulling on the runs and not reeling. Get a jump? No, I think this is just coming in. Kelp bass. Whoa! Let's catch the whale! have another video where I kind of burn through all the new US West DLC locations only spend a couple minutes at each and uh, you don't get to see that whale if you're only spending two minutes here or very unlikely So one of the handy controls, if you're not aware, is the uh, kind of instant reel in, if you want to just cast. Uh, and that's just pull back on the analog stick of your rod hand. No trigger at all. Just pull back for like a second and a half, and then it's going to pull your line right in. Previously, I was kind of thinking that you needed to do like some combination of the trigger and the analog stick, but it's just the analog stick. It just, uh, there is a pause, so you gotta wait that second and a half with the analog stick back before it's gonna come in. Now, I'm using the spinner to try to get a smaller fish so that I can get a larger shark taking the smaller fish, but um, I may end up switching if we get a dry spot here. Saw bubbles there, which means low, so let the lure drop. There we go. 
got something running. Can't quite tell. Ooh, pretty far though. Where is it going? Oh, we're gonna lose it here. Nope. I don't like those kind of away and towards me runs because it's hard to tell which one it is. I'm liking this not reeling on the runs. Ooh, that's blue. No good, no good. Too much blue. And what are you? Striped bass. Huh. That went in at a strange angle. I think maybe after this we'll switch to the spoon. See if we can tempt anything else. Okay. There we go. Well, that's another whale, I suppose. Pull that one back. see some bubbles so I'm going to recast. Okay, there's a surface distortion there. Oh, we nailed it. And some bubbles kind of beside it. That shallow fish is not interested in this lure it would seem. Let's try something else for these two. All right. Yeah, we were having better luck with the spinner.
You can get fish pretty close to the boat. So, uh, I would try not to get into the habit of pulling in your casts really early, because they, they may still be successful. Okay, that's right on that surface thing, but it's not going for this either. So let's go for the, uh, what is it, the soft bait? There we go. Looks like that got him. Okay. We got some green. Green means go. One way, other way. We're gonna get a jump. Nope. One way, other way. Now we're gonna get a jump. Nope. Didn't get the snap there, unfortunately. And that might cost us. Gonna get a jump. Nope. Got the snap that time. Trying to go less aggressive into the red and not reel so much on the runs. Blue, blue, green is good. We're gonna get a jump. Didn't get the snap there either. Hopefully, oh, we're gonna lose them because we didn't get the snap. Oh, no. We got another chance. Another chance at romance here. We just gotta do better with our snaps. paying such keen attention to the direction of the runs. I'm not paying attention to the direction of the jumps enough. Being forgiving though. Uh oh, no, 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 no. We're gonna lose it here. It's just taking us too long. Oh, we got the snap. Where are you gonna go? Got another snap and we got some green. That's two runs. Three. We didn't get the snap there. That's a lot of missed snaps with this fish. Got it that time. And we're pretty close now. I don't think we'll get another jump. We just gotta... Take it easy. Oh, that's harsh. That was a lot of fight for that ending. We'll go back to the same spot. We needed to get more of those snaps.
Just taunting us at the end there. Now, it's always seemed to me like the fish go back to the same location no matter where they ran while you were reeling them in, but uh, let me know in the comments what your experience has been in that regard. Maybe it takes them some time to, to swim back. Now this bait sinks slower than the others, so you gotta kinda give it a little more time. I think I'm gonna try flicking my snaps. More wrist, less less arm movement. Maybe that'll be quicker. Trying to get that same fish on. But uh, I'd be okay with other fish too. Okay, let's go for this deep water one straight ahead. Mm, not too bad. We'll let it sink. Whatever that is seems to be going in the general direction. Oh yeah. Huh. Not much resistance here so far. Whoa, we got our shark on. I did touch the trigger, so we may lose it here just from reeling distance. No, we got a chance. Okay, that's two runs. There's three runs. We should have a jump here. Nope. After this one, then. Didn't get the snap. We're going to lose it. I don't still on. Two. We're going to get a jump. Nope. Another run. Another run. We got some green. snap that time. Easy. Okay, should have another jump here. 
Oh, I'm gonna lose it here. Oh no, we still got line. We got the snap. Which way are you going? That way. Easy. Other way. Gonna get a jump. We got the snap that time. We got some green. Got some blue. No, no red. Other way. Let him go. Gonna get a jump here. No other way. Okay, we got some blue. Probably gonna be a jump now. We got the snap. Don't touch the red. Still pretty far out. Okay, let's put the third run. Don't let the whale distract us. We didn't get the snap there. He's running because we didn't get the snap. Okay. Two runs. Three runs. Here comes a jump. Nope. Man, I'm going crazy with the snaps, but I'm not getting them. Must be the direction thing. Other way. Got it that time. Got to pay attention to the direction and not just go on instinct. Oh, he's running now. Lost them. Yeah, they seem to punish you when you don't get the snaps. Like, why would it all of a sudden run there and snap the line? Instead of one of the previous ones. Like, we should have had plenty of line there. I guess it didn't snap the line because we kept the lure. I'm not sure what the deal is. Yeah, I think I gotta focus more on the direction of the snap rather than the uh, reaction time. So if I take that extra fraction of a second to make sure that I know the proper direction before snapping, that's gonna be beneficial, I think. Okay. California halibut. Okay, this seems like a small fish. Maybe we'll get another another shark bite. Still try to get our snaps though. Gotta practice on the small fish. 
if they jump. You are a small fish, a small happy looking fish, that's for sure. Garibaldi fish, rare. Well, this bait's working out for us. Something in the deep over there that we haven't caught yet. That's running pretty far. One way. Away, other way, should get a jump now. Remember to check the direction. Doesn't look like anything too special, but we'll do our best. Be another jump soon. Got some green. Getting pretty close for a jump. I don't think there'll be any more jumps. Oh! Another shark. Another leopard shark. Right? That's what the other one was. Good looking fish, that. They don't look that impressive in the water at a distance. Can't be too upset with two sharks. That was a strange one. No preamble, just right on the hook. Still get a jump out of this one, whatever it is. <laughs> we didn't get the snap. That's funny on this tiny fish. Yeah, I went the wrong way with the snap. Gotta remember. Take a pause. California Corbina. Make sure you know which way the jump is before you snap.
<laughs> okay. I don't know uh, how that works exactly. But uh, we still got the fish on the hook. Gonna jump now? Nope. Going the wrong way against the run there. Ah. Gonna lose him? Yeah, I went the wrong way on that uh, on that snap and then tried to correct. Sometimes my arm is just in the wrong position to uh, to snap the direction that I need to. So maybe that's something to adjust as well. Try to keep my arm more central while I'm fighting the fish so that I can snap either direction. Okay, something small, shark bait. Spotted sand bass. Huh. Don't recall seeing one of them, or not in a while at least. this in. I'm seeing some bubbles and surface distortion. Ah, that's not quite the right spot. But, oh, that shallow one looks like it might be interested. Sometimes the fish can uh, be drawn in from quite a ways out. Those bubbles seem to be getting closer. Definitely things happening over there.
keep it in the center in case of a jump. And that way. Okay, it should be a jump soon. Which way though? Pretty close for a jump. No, looks like we're not going to get a jump. Oh, another halibut. It's not quite where I wanted it. Let's pull that in. Yeah, seem to be. Let's pull that in too. I'm trying to go right between those two. That's pretty good. Not exactly, but uh, good enough. I think maybe we'll switch back to the spinner after this. A couple more casts and then we'll call it a day. Well, oh, maybe the spinner wasn't the right choice either. Ought to be somewhat patient though. not where we wanted. Let's pull that one back. That's basically where I just cast. <laughs> Still wants to go that way. That's better.
Something small. It's the kind of thing we want a shark to take. I wonder if we should, you know, play with it a bit. We're not going to get a shark this close, I don't think. Ooh, look at you. Epic. Monkey face prickleback. You got a monkey face? Is that what you got, monkey face? Well, an epic's nice to end the day on. Wriggling around. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers. It would be fantastic if you were one of them. Also, like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video or the game or any tips or tricks you have for real VR fishing. Thanks for watching. And we'll catch you next time.